Are you scheduling your workouts? Are you scheduling a meal prep times? Like, all right, Wednesdays, I prep my food. I grocery shop at this time on Wednesdays. I cook for this long. Try to find these little pockets in your day. And so today is all about calendar optimization. What do you use your calendar for? Like events, do you use it for like your work day? Like this is the time I work, you put it on there. Do you even use your calendar? If you're in a mind body performance training app, you understand that the calendar is what we focus on a lot. That's where your workouts are. That's where your habits are. If we're tracking habits, that's you know, where I can go in there and see what you ate for that day. The calendar, are you scheduling your workouts? Are you scheduling a meal prep times? Like, all right, Wednesdays, I prep my food. I grocery shop at this time on Wednesdays. I cook for this long. Like, are you putting that inside of your calendar? It's giving them not only like clarity, but like something to look forward to. Something to look forward to instead of like, oh, I forgot. I have to do a grocery shopping today. Oh, I forgot I gotta work out today. You know, you have it on your schedule, you have it on your calendar, and your calendar becomes a tool. It becomes a resource. So I highly recommend, that's what we went over during the, the, the roll call was calendar. You know, have a calendar, have a schedule, have a routine where it's not, you're not even thinking about it anymore. Or whether I'm trying to, you know, learn how to build a website or learn how to edit a video or learn how to, whatever I'm trying to learn, is I'll just add that stuff into the calendar. Like I try to find these little pockets in your day where you can add, all right, I was always trying to read for an hour a day, but before bed, I always get tired. You know, I'm not really feeling it, but I found 30 minutes of my commute to and from work. So those two 30 minutes combined to an hour, now I'm listening to an audiobook or reading for an hour. You see how you can kind of, you can kind of switch up your routine like that. So I highly recommend you use your calendar. Don't let it use you. Because I promise you, if you have nothing in your calendar, somebody will come and fill that for you. Because if you're not doing anything, you're kind of just wafting in the air like a leaf. Like a leaf. It's a lot easier to stick to a routine once it's on the calendar, I promise, than if it's not. Comment down below your next question that you'd like me to answer next video. Love you and I'll talk to you guys next video.